Good morning, and we are in Lymington today. Uh, the sun is shining. Um, it's cows week, so we're going back to Northney, and the only way we can do that without going through the middle of the cows week traffic is go round the south of the island. Are we ready, Klaus? <laughs> yes, absolutely ready. I'm really excited to go around the whole island. Um, I'm a little bit worried about the 15, 20 meter high waves you announced to us, so <laughs> it's going to be crazy. <laughs> Jack? Yeah, very much looking forward to it. Lovely day, so yeah. it's going to be excellent. What speed are we doing, Jackie? We are doing 4.4. 4. Oh, okay. It's a good <laughs> So, um, we're, we're trying to maintain a speed of five and a half knots uh, in order to get round, do the journey in seven hours. And we're kind of up to six and down to four, so we're kind of bouncing along at the moment. Hopefully, when we get out of the shadow of the cliffs, uh, Tennyson down here, uh, the wind will free up and we'll go a little bit quicker. But in the meantime, it's butty time. So, in today's butty, we're going to try uh, some sausages which were purchased on Hailing Island at a cooperative. These are Hampshire's own award winning sausages, Tree Gusts, Old English. Well, it's certainly a good-looking sausage, there's no doubt in there. Choice of bread. We have the large white baps. We have some superseded in a sandwich shape, a bloomer. Um, and these ready to, well, ready to, see we're, we're bouncing a little, ready to roll rolls. I think we'll go for the large white baps. Butty score. Butty score. Butty score. Quite a spicy sausage. It's got a little bite, a little peppery edge. Very, very nice. So, Klaus, how did you, uh, how did you like the butty? I really, really like it. Um, I mean, it is an English sausage. It's not a German sausage. <laughs> <laughs> it's really, really good, though. And Jackie, how was your? the butty this morning oh amazing just just what i needed it's a bit chilly on deck at the moment and yeah perfect very good the beeping sound is the alarm to say that there's somebody in distress somewhere so we better go and see what that's about So the wind's dying off a little bit and we're slowing down as we're coming up towards St Catherine's Point or St Cat's. So um, we're averaging about three and a half, four. Now we, we're making up for it earlier so the average speed is still probably within our margin. But um, we're trying to decide how long we can hang on to the sails. I think we'll try until St Catherine's and then we'll see when we turn. 
whether we've got enough breeze to continue sailing to maintain a speed sufficient to get home before dark. The southernmost tip of the Isle of Wight, I give you St Catherine's Lighthouse. So let's take time out to analyse what just happened. We were a couple of miles east of the southernmost tip of the Isle of Wight when the drivers of three personal watercraft stopped to ask us, a passing yacht, where the closest fuel was. The implication being that they were running low. The closest place to buy petrol would have been Sparks Marina on Hailing Island which is about 16 nautical miles away and the second closest, Lymington, is around 25 nautical miles. They didn't appear to know where they were they may have gone over their available fuel range and they didn't know where the available fuel stations were in their cruising area. If that's not a tale of caution, I don't know what is. So I track it up now, it's just there. That way behind us now. And about six miles to go to West Pole. Uh, so we get into just Harbour. It's been a bit fluky, but it's picking up again and it's in the right direction now, which is great news. And uh, probably time for a sandwich, I think. Or a nap. Again. <laughs> never known a crew member sleep so much. <laughs> oh, look at that. Look at that for an angle. That's brilliant. Got the horizon and then you. <laughs> yeah, yes. That's impressive. So that's been an amazing sail from Lymington. We're just cleaning up now. So that's it. We've had a fantastic day. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for um, joining us. And please uh, make sure you like and subscribe um, Johnny's YouTube channel. <laughs> and thanks for watching. Thank you for watching. Yay. Take care.